Here we are again with some more Fox Pro Coyote calling action. Two coyote stands for you, one from the Midwest and one from east of the Mississippi. And again, if you're looking for more information on our coyote stands, be sure to stick around to the end of this video for the stand breakdowns. We've had a pretty good couple of days of hunting. we got one morning left, Jeff. We might as well kill at least one or two more, haven't we? I like to. It's like, uh, what was it, 60, 62 degrees this morning. Pretty calm. So that can sometimes cause us a little bit of trouble. Thermal's floating around, but I'm sure we'll be able to fight it a little bit and get some coyotes called in, so you guys stay tuned. Hang it right off that fence post like that and see what we can grab right about that big draw down there. Got it there. Yep. Yeah. How did that coyote not wind us? <laughs> it was kind of blowing right down this right here. That coyote come from behind us. I caught it bouncing over to the left, coming right through there. Look. That's an older coyote. Yeah, he's old. We've killed a couple older coyotes on this trip. It's pretty awesome. X24 caught every single one of them in. Jeff, appreciate the hunting, old buddy. Yeah. That's some hot sign right there. We're back in central Kentucky making a couple mid morning coyote stands. Come along with us, see what we can call up. I really like our setup right here. That road we just walked in on, full of coyote tracks going up and down it. Got a head of holler right here. A ridge that runs out to the right there. It's got corn on it, standing corn. And then we've got a hay field runs out to the left out of ridge. We'll play on a little bit of rabbit. See if we can't call us something out. We killed one last week to pray to stress so it's time it's cool this morning played that rabbit for about three and a half four minutes nothing so I'm going to go right back into some pup stuff. I'm going to play some MFK, some missive beggar. Hey, right here, Scott. Right here, Scott. Like to have never got that coyote to stop. What about that? <laughs> I am shaking like a leaf. When that coyote decided to come, it came, buddy. 
that coyote there was on a mission come within steps of the x24 and finally finally got it stopped within steps of the x24 and was able to get a v max in it. that's a pretty coyote right there excellent shaped coyote on that first stand from Kansas, we pulled out the old fence post trick. That's one of the cool features of the X24 is that stand. It allows you to hang it from things such as a fence post to get the call elevated. We started that stand off with Fox Pro's female sore house. We ran that out and waited about two minutes and went right into MFK's Lil B 11 week pup. Didn't take long. We had an ancient coyote come from our left, come right through the fence, circled right out there in front of our gun barrel. Got it there. Yep. Coyote. <laughs> Our second stand from Kentucky produced another hard charging coyote. We started that stand off with Baby Cottontail. Ran that sound for about four to five minutes. We then paused for 30 seconds and went right into MFK Submissive Beggar. We played that for two to three minutes, paused for 30 to 45 seconds after Submissive Beggar, and then went right into MFK's Fight Challenge. Kind of told a story. A rabbit caught by a coyote, two coyotes got together and some submissive sounds were going on, and then all of a sudden a full out fight. And sure enough, that coyote couldn't stand it, come rushing right in, running right up on top of the X24, barely got the thing stopped, and coyote down. Thanks for joining us right here on Fox Pro Hunting TV.